when Argentini and his he is part of the managerial team for the 30-year-old. Kaz is a softball. There's a left hook that great double-digit title defenses, which doesn't matter who you're in. Set for 12. There's a left uppercut. It's un interesting to me that the pocket early. There's a left hook. As you look at them, they're both 30 years of age, but in Kaz, as Rick said, Cerrone signed. Stop! Resume. And Sherwin and Cajas unbeat. There's a left hook by Martinez. Martinez. Sherwin and Cajas. The guidance of being quite active here in this first round against Cajas. Sweeping up percentage of 61%. There's a left hook. There's a straight left down. The one to the second round. This one's scheduled for 12. Trying to make Sherwin and Cajas uncomfortable. You set the tone here in the second round. Presidents, to his credit as a professional, in Cajas, as Martinez, Conor left hook, Conor left by in Cajas. There's a left hook to the body by Mar Martinez, throws a hook. Martinez is expending a lot of energy there, Martinez. Very much of a belief to counter in. Surprising cause he's using his jab. Now the Martinez sensing the fact that Martinez in his jab a little bit more. There's a right hook to the body. Grabbing the head. There's a beautiful right hook. Counter. Final 20 seconds of the second. There's a counter. The second. We'll see if Ancaz can adjust. There's a left hook upstairs by Martinez. There's a right hook to the body. Martinez seems to be the fresh of the two. There's a left hook this third round. He's getting driven. Wasn't Cajas. Boy, these guys are fun to watch. Right. And the Argentinian fans voicing their pleasure. Jack comes. And Cajas, there's a left hook connecting on it. Cajas. There's a right upstairs. Martinez hustling here. But Buzz, you want to put him in these precarious positions that he's not... Mark. As we are approaching the one over Gary Russell Jr. last month in Atlantic City. Under 30 seconds to go. Oh, there's a left that buckled the knees. Promotional stablemates with Mark Maxayan, who just picked off his adversary, and look at that! There's a left hook by Martinez, the title defenses. Sherwin and Cajas, a nine to the title back on September 3rd, 26th. Caught. That has been, that is outside the left eye. AJ, hey go to replay, I think it was a punch. Make Joel Arroyo, who was undefeated at the time. There's a left hook there by Reese Talley. The commission, he needs to go. He is, that G80 will have the ability to do so for his aggressive come forward style. I think it's so interesting that both rank number four in the world by the IBF rankings. Martinez not to be denied here. 30 seconds to go here in the fourth. Martinez can Cajas. I'd love to see so action between these two. Eight, a big left from Encajas. There's a left hook there. Toe to toe seesaw affair. We're heading to the. Because if somehow Fernando Martinez. So cannot continue. Completed, we go to the scorecard. So we're already. We'll go to the scorecards. There's a nice combination there. Left uppercut. 
Martinez. Martinez coming out swinging wildly. Left hook up, stand right hooks, and then following a straight right. Marcos Cross, Cross, and digging deepest Martin, between German and Kaz, the champion, and Fernando Martinez, right? Number of straighter punches. With these sort of whirlwind left set here at ringside. Just over the halfway point, book by Martinez. Oh. Left by Encajas. There's a Stepping in, lunging with the left was Martinez. By Fernando Martinez and Kaz eating some big left hook there by Martinez. Two big left hooks there by the arch to come later tonight. It'll be Chris Colbert matching up against Hector Garcia. There's a comes in Kaz, the Filipino. Oh, this is some fun. Chris Colbert getting ready for his main event matchup against Hector. is landing of 205 for a 30% connect percentage. Martinez has doubled that. He's 126 in the first half of the fight. And Cajas is used to being in his, is will he slow down and he's higher connect percentage. But he just ate some big shots. My man is eating up on Cajas. Going downstairs to the body. As a minute plus has elapsed in the sixth. He's a lot faster to the draw. He's throwing quicker. I'll say this, that Martinez is probably thrown by Martinez. Martinez would love nothing more. State of elation. There's a left hook. Sneaky left. Martinez looking to get that back. But he ate a straight left. He got moment. Cajas stabs him with the right hook to the body. To Martinez. But Martinez. 60 seconds left here in the sick. Oh, by a chopping right hand. Look at this. Big near. Can he finish off? The champion will back comes in Cajas. Martinez, couple uppercuts. Cajas. And drives in Cajas back. And Cajas going backwards. Martinez. Another one just left hook in abundance. It's big left hook. Look at that combination. What a fight through six. And has the higher connect percentage compared to that of Encop. We are now into the seventh round. There's a right that connected by my percentage. We'll see if Encajas can make adjustments. Power. Martinez, oh, there's a big right hand. That moment, Encajas. 75 seconds in care from a bleeding perspective. It's to go here in the seventh. Martinez to Encajas. Enjoy the lighter weight classes because they do stuff like this. Look, talk. Encajas is going to have to do something significant. Martinez still pressing the excellent fight. And this is why one of the many Roman and looking to make his dream become a reality. Go! Through seven in Kaz, 96 of his champion in boxing. Vintage Martinez is nearly landing the fight. They are telling the story. Percentage are close to 44%, but in Martinez to keep his punches up. Champion since that of September 3rd, 20. Fight. They are telling the story. Upper grabs. He has been a champion. He's very much a champion. He's looking to make his to champion since that of September 3rd, 20. Lo Martinez, the 30 year old from Argentina. Cajas just went the distance against Chuck. This work rate and this fervor. Under a minute to go here in the eighth. The 12 round decision. Back comes. Cost looking to dig deep, he knows he needs some. It's a right hook upstairs by Martinez. Machine gun like burst upon in Cajas and isn't moving with as much fluidity as that of his. Cajas just seems to have his feet on the eye. 16 of 75, great 21%. Thought he had a cut on his left They are not judges. Look at this combination by my percentage. So he's landing nearly 50% of his punches. Big right to at least potentially, at least in the eyes of ringside observers, Indian contender. 
Kaz just took a big deep breath and he just he throws. He is just at this feverish pace and he throwing him with punches from a bevy of angles. There's a right, a three punch combination from Fernando Martin, like a pest dispenser. Probably wondering what that is. Been successful in the process. It's like the whirlwind in a thing. This is the first time he's fighting here. Martinez just continues to unload. Look at that. Four. Unless Argentina says no, no, no. Let's pack a stadium with you for 20. Juan Cost needs a big shot here. He has a 61 and possessed. And here's my big run. You would think that he has three rounds left in Vegas. And right away, you know what the MO is, classes that they could get old overnight. Now pressing the issue, trying not to give him any to, and it could be the back of the pressure of Fernando. There's a beautiful shot there. They both into his clothes and execute his game plan. Big Martinez is disrupting the rhythm, and the uh, curious to see if there's a sense of urgency in the corner of Kinkajas. I cannot believe how this guy's still standing, but they're approaching the championship rounds. Well, you know that they say, you know, we don't have exactly what Fernando Martinez is doing. He is slugging. This is just tremendous, but nice combination of the body by Cajas. But look at Acosta there. He is bringing it to Jordan and Cajas. And in Cajas is a six-round TKO win over him. Miguel going gambling city here in Las Vegas. It's like being the riverboat gambling boat. He's still hammering away upon Joe and Kyle. Try to sort of cut it. You're going to have to gamble quite a bit. High risk, high reward. Champion in boxing in Jerwin and Kahas. The way upon one another. Look at what they are doing inside this ring. And yes, the issue, and he's done that all night long. I mean, he did in the first three of. Jerwin and Cajas typically been looking for the head and the jaw and the chin and the chin through the 12th. Well, he has answered the question. Most importantly, is IBF Junior Bantamweight Chiyoka the WBO Super Flyweight Champion? They say not so fast. There is a new in the books. Look at this. He continues to hammer away upon Jerwin and Cajas, a young man in town, and he's from Argentina. Championship goal to their native country. And Kaz going back to the fifth. Martinez. Decision. Here are the score total. 118 to 110. Fernando.